back for another Monday video. It's Elizabeth. I'm here today to watch YouTubers that I haven't watched before. I saw my Instagram, who you watch on YouTube, and it was very nice because some of my friends did say me, thank you so much friends. I consume a lot of content. I consume a lot of YouTuber content. A lot of the YouTubers that were recommended were some that I've already watched. There are a good amount that I've never heard of. I've heard of but I haven't watched ever. And so we're gonna dive into some YouTubers today. Hopefully y'all will find a new YouTuber that you can subscribe to. YouTube is an amazing place and I think any creators that get to collaborate together, show other creators on their channel, I love it. This is something I've wanted to do for a while and I'm finally freaking doing it. We're gonna watch together. Thank you to everyone who did contribute. Rhyme, I don't know who Rhyme is. It's a thousand subscribers. Okay, that's pretty cool. Poetry or something? I picked a random video. Weatherwood grows. Oh. I am. Where the fur falls, I am. When the saints bow, I stand. The clock reads zero, 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 zero. It never changes. A stray cloud and a UFO as quickly spotted dissipates. And a purple house on the hill of Twin Pines might not be entered this lifetime. But glorious its view, we can move it closer. We're in the credence of nighttime. Hmm. Interesting. Ryan presents her lo-fi series of poetry. So these are all original poems by this girl. What an interesting concept for a YouTube channel. I really like her voice. Like she's very ASMR E. Like she should be an ASMR YouTuber too. Marky Plier? Oh, Mark. Okay, no, I know who this is. It's crazy that there are, you know, small YouTubers like myself and like Rhyme, and then there's YouTubers like this that they'll have like less than a thousand subscribers or 32.8 million and there's still people who don't know who they are or don't watch them it's just really cool i'm night at freddy's revisited oh i might want to watch that one like i i know i like his energy already i'm just gonna go like to the middle what the hell was that <laughs> have i seen that did i see that in my I'm actually, I don't know if y'all have ever played, but I, if you haven't played this game and you like gas, scary so games and things like that, like I, this, I know, a jump what? scare moment, yeah. this is the game for you. Okay. Night 4, 2 a.m. Okay. I, I, I've seen that character in future games. We made it an hour. Oh. By accident, I thought it was time to, I was, uh, my gas are flabbered. <laughs> I'm a oh, I like him. I like him. I watch him for two hours play that game. That's fun. He's, he, I, I mean, he's someone I know and recognize and I've seen collab with other people before, so. Dashy, is that another gamer? Dash Games. Six million subscribers. Oh, are these the new tracks for Mario? Oh, let's watch this video. It's Dashy, and welcome back. Yes, back to the DLC part. Oh, he's he drinks Red Bull constantly. Okay, Tokyo War, here we go. I've played these tracks now at this point. But I'm interested to see if he has any secret paths that and shortcuts that I don't know of. Ooh, Yoshi. Okay. Oh my gosh. They like best friends. They best friends out here. Okay, I'm about to separate them. Yeah, let's go. Come on now. Come on now, let's get it. Come on, Dashi Games. I love playing Mario Kart. I could watch people play Mario Kart all day long. Any kind of racing game, I could watch forever. We would get along playing this game because we talk very similarly. Oh! Didn't know that existed. It's just like Japan, but them shits is everywhere out there. Here we go. Oh, I hear somebody Wait, that's the last lap? What? Uh-oh. Okay, let me just... I don't know why I slowed down, but I felt like I needed to right there. You know what? Sometimes you feel like you need to. I get it. Oh, my God. Who, who is... Who is... Who is doing this? Oh. Go, go, go. You gotta go, you gotta go, you gotta go! No, no, no! Right now, he really stole the first spot from me. 
I'm into it. It's just a lot. You can't watch him as you're going to bed. Like, I'm gonna watch this YouTuber to fall asleep. Uh-uh, not him, that's for sure. My one friend sent me a literal paragraph of names that I should watch. YouTuber X Philosopher. Oh, these are, oh my goodness, these videos. Green, like. So, April 27, 2017 was the greatest day in the history of Twitter.com. What day was it? What happened? This was the day that Fire Festival, a luxury music oh, hosted by Ja Rule Yes! Love the setup! Like just chilling on the stairs, like I'm about to talk about Fire Festival and Envy and all this stuff. It's like so well done, I love it. Sufferable Instagram. So, when the day arrived and the advertised best in food, art, music, and adventure, <laughs> Turned out to be two slices of pallid American cheese languishing over sliced bread in an atmosphere that can only be described as muddy third world shanty town. I mean, if you weren't on Twitter that day, I don't think you can even imagine the revelry. I'm into her storytelling. That's like four minutes into this long video on Envy. Like, I'm so, does she sit there the whole time? Oh, she goes all over the place. There's so many YouTubers. I'm gonna watch a couple more. Video essays about things that interest me. Like, video essays. Oh my gosh, Boy Meets World. I was literally, I literally saw something about this this morning. As one of my favorite fictional couples of all time. No, not Corey and Topanga. I'm talking about Sean and Angela. Facts. Let's talk about that for Facts. a little bit. Facts. That's what I am, T1J. Follow me. When I was growing up, <laughs> Follow me. I loved Boy Meets World. Me freaking too. I love Boy Meets World. I'm to explain why, but I think it just came out at the right time for me. I really love sitcoms. And I don't mean like I love a lot of sitcoms. I mean, I love I all of them. I love, love the genre. sitcoms so that. much. I so clean. Like, I, I wonder what camera he uses. Like, I love sitcoms way more than comedy movies or other types of comedic media. Hmm. He should have like a million followers. I can listen to his voice and his storytelling for so long. Ghost Town Living. I want to know whoever that is because that sounds very interesting to me. Living in an abandoned ghost town. Trying to bring it back to life. I mean, I guess I saved the best for last. 1.5 million subscribers. How has no one ever told me about this person before? Two years I've been living up here now, and I realize I haven't given anybody a proper tour in all the buildings. Wow! So you look at all the progress that's been going on up here in the last two years. I love so this. I love this. Here. So we're gonna move in here. Feels very Westworld. <laughs> storage you know this was where just storage. anything wow. that was unseen or unwanted would go and it was pretty much floor to ceiling with just junk i actually watched the super bowl in here not too long ago and so if you look there's these beautiful theater chairs in here now we have a little projector set up hmm. one of the things that we've been thinking about a lot the of things that we want to do is maybe create kind of like a film festival you know, Chris and I have been going back and forth. I just am so happy that I have found so many different, eclectic, small, large, medium-sized YouTubers. Thank y'all for your suggestions. There were so many that I didn't watch. Like this video if you enjoyed it. Comment down below if you want to see me do this again so y'all can find new YouTubers to watch as well. And subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet because I post a video every single Monday and on Fridays I post my tier list videos. And I will see you next Monday. Boom, boom, bye.